Hi, today we are going to learn fourth normal form. A relation R is in fourth normal form if for all multivalued dependency of the form x multivalued determines y that belongs to D closer. This is a multivalued dependency closer. It is similar to your F closer in functional dependency. Then D closer we have taken as a multivalued dependency. Uh, here if you can generate in this way, if there is a multivalued dependency, we can find the sum. So if x multivalued determines y, there should be two conditions in the OR if it holds it is in 4NF. So either x multivalued determine y is a trivial multivalued dependency or x is a super key of R. As we have seen in the BCNF, if x multi x function determines y, it doesn't matter what is y, x should be a super key. And we know 4NF implies BCNF. But 4NF is a more stronger form of BCNF. So if a relation is 4NF, it means it is already in BCNF. So now we can see how can we can uh, how we can make a relation which is not in 4NF into 4NF. If there is a relation, it, it has some functional dependency or multivalued dependency and uh, or is that relation is not in 4NF, we can decompose a relation into 4NF with lossless join. So what is the algorithm for decomposition? First, if the relation that uh, is given, we will find the key and we will verify the multivalue dependency which violates the 4NF. Which violates 4NF mean if it is non-trivial relation then A should be a super key. So if it violates we decompose R that relation A multiple determines B this relation we decompose into R1 and R2. Let's take one example also in the same way. See, if there is a relation R and this multivalue dependency holds and it violates the 4NF, there is no key here. <coughs> so R1, R2, if decomposition would be in this form, R1 will be A and B and R2 will be A and remaining attributes which is C. And we will find the key of R1 and R2. Here is only two, three, so it is already in 4NF. For more than three, we will find the key of R1 and R2. We again check and we repeat until the relation is not in 4NF. We will again check the functional dependency and multivalue dependency for the relation and for and we will find if there is a multivalue dependency that violates the 4NF we will again break in this procedure till all the relation would be in 4NF. Thank you.